Okay, so it turns out that each different biome has different recipes associated with them. I was previously over at the Desert Antiquarian Realm and I got some new recipes from the Essence Trader. And also, I found this NPC here who has a quest over them. And this is the Swamp Antiquarian Biome. Blue Divine Saint Claire, I will return with the remedies. Okay, so it seems like a bunch of her people are sick and she needs me to craft some remedies. Can make it in the simple alchemical broiler. And it needs T1 Swamp Fiber, Hide Glass, and Essence Dust. Okay, I am over at the Essence Trader in the Swamp Antiquarium. It's all the way down here. And this dude actually sells T1 Fiber. There it is. Plant Fiber, T1 Swamp Fiber, and this is what I need. Okay, so I have the recipe for a simple alchemical broiler, which is what I need in order to craft the potions. I think I'll just put it right here. Seems to connect to a lot of stations. I also went to a head and upgraded all my tools. So I have refined wood axe, refined all of these tools, which I crafted in the refined workbench. And if you go over to the pistol, you can see I need all of these things. So if I put something like, if I go into this thing and I put stock, so it's not in here and I can just go through all the stations until I find which one makes a stock. So there we go. This one makes a stock. And I kind of just went through like that until I got all the pieces that I need. And I should be able to craft the pistol now. There we go. It's going to take a little bit to craft. And then I went ahead and gave Millie all my old stuff. So if you look at Millie, all the simple stuff that I had upgraded was like level 40. And all the new stuff that I crafted right now at base is level is around level 40. And this is the trapper's coat and all of that stuff. Okay, these guys are ready, so I should be able to go and complete her quest. Also, there are Twitch rewards for the game. So if I go over to System Rewards, I didn't claim these. I for totally forgot about these, but I'm going to go ahead and claim them now. And the Umbrella. No rewards available. Okay, ooh, I got them in my inventory. Holy shit, this thing is insane. 37, 50... Oh, these are way better than what I have. Okay. I'm not sure where the dog went. I think the dog was a reward, but I don't see him. So I don't know. I don't know about that. Okay. I'm back at the NPC with the curative potions. I have the potions as requested. Okay. So I think she unlocked. Yeah, she unlocked an amphibious card. I'm not sure what that does. And her quest is complete. Okay. In the desert astrolabe, there's another NPC, Victor Frankenstein. I think he might be all the way up there. Yeah, he's probably all the way up there. So I'm guessing each biome with respect to the difficulty card. So for example, Astrolabe, um, Antiquarian, Provisioner probably have different NPCs. So it's probably a good idea to visit all of them. Otherwise, I'd probably be missing out in, on a lot of recipes. What was that? Tier 1, Automation, Bishop. Ooh, what is this? Tier 1 Automation Bishop. Okay. Well, oh, there's a chest here. We can I not... Oh, I can't access this. Awesome. Fortunate. Ooh. Difference Engine. I am Victor Frankenstein, and it is the secrets of heaven and earth I desire to learn. Both the outward substance of things and the inner spirit of their nature. By the time you return, I should have ascertained more details on their bishops. Let's hope for all our sakes. Okay, so I have to acquire a whole bunch of stuff. Acquire lumbar U, acquire ingots, acquire raw gem, petrified ichor, acquire ingots, hollow metal, unlock gloom card okay okay so if i'm not mistaken the u is from like those big ass giant dudes that i was fighting and i think it was in the forest provisioner so let me head over there and gather one of those oh i found this thing offering altar in the forest provisioner realm i don't know what that does but it says i guess let me try adding wood and see what that does What? Oh, what the heck did you do? Oh, what the fuck? Holy shit. What is this thing? What the fuck? Oh, 
Oh, I'm barely doing any damage. Oh my goodness, I'm assuming that blue thing is the... Why is the bear after me? Maybe I have to use an axe? Oh, I can't cross. Oh, there we go. Axe is the way, axe is the way. Oh my goodness, where did you go? What the fuck, level 40? Holy shit. Oh, this is so bad. I can't. I'm trapped. Oh my goodness, this is how I die. Oh, everything froze. Whoa, 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 what the fuck? Do I just have to stay trapped here? Like, oh, there we go. Let me try taking these guys down. Oh, this is not optimal. Oh, Millie, no. Let me at least take this guy down. Here we go, and then go for the bear. There we go, bear is down, and now try to go for this fucking tree. I wonder what would have happened if I made like a different offering. For example, if I use stone, would I have summoned like a stone golem? Kind of sucks that I don't do a lot of damage with the bullets. Axe is definitely the way to go here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Chill, buddy. Let me heal up a little bit. Okay, and then I think I can get him now. I think I got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's dead. Totally was not expecting that. That thing is crazy. What do we do now? Is it done? Oh, I can harvest this. Oh, please don't tell me he's going to come back to life. Was that all? I think so. I got I got some uh, Eton heart thingies. Where are they? Oh, there we go. EO10 heart. I don't know what that does. And then I got some lumbar. Oh, it's probably this one, tier one, Eoton wood. I came here looking for you wood, but I haven't found like any of those giant creature thingies. Okay, so if you go into your journal, you can look at your quest and it actually tells you where everything comes from. So arcane wicks can be acquired by killing bound lamplighters. Brown pistol can be acquired by killing bound vermin. And so lumbar you can be acquired by killing bound bruisers. Some of these I don't think I've come across, for example, Bound Assassins, I don't think I've seen those. And Bound Dark Weavers, I might not have seen those either. So I think for this quest, it's probably best to just leave it on the back burner and let it happen as I progress. Because if I just go around specifically looking for all of those things, it'll probably take hours and I may not even be able to complete it. So I was thinking that every different uh, biome in each difficulty would have a different NPC associated with them, but that's actually not the case. So for example, the forest astrolabe does not have any NPCs on the map, whereas the desert astrolabe did have an NPC. Okay, I think I'm finally done. What I did was I visited each different biome for each tier difficulty. Basically what I mean is uh, for Antiquarian, I visited the forest, swamp, and desert. For Astrolabe, I visited the forest, swamp, and desert. And then for Provisioner, I visited the forest, swamp, and desert. Um, each essence trader in each biome for each difficulty has different recipes. So the essence trader in the forest, swamp, and desert Antiquarian all have different recipes. The essence traders in forest, desert, and swamp Astrolabe all have different recipes. Recipes. Similarly, the Essence Trader in Forest, Swamp, and Desert Provisioner uh, biomes all have different recipes. So if you just follow the main story quest, which takes you through Antiquarian Forest, and then I believe it takes you through Provisioner Forest, it completely skips um, the Astrolabe, you're going to miss out on a lot of recipes. So as you go through each like um, 
outside of power in each difficulty tier, it's probably a good idea to visit the different biomes in that difficulty tier. And then from what I have seen so far, it seems, I don't know if this will change down the road or if it'll change in the future, but at the moment, one biome for each difficulty tier has a NPC quest. So from what I've seen, it was the Swamp Antiquarian, and then it was the Desert Astrolabe, and then the Forest Provisioner sites that had a NPC quest. In the Swamp Antiquarian, it was some lady that needs um, you to craft some potions to heal the sick. Uh, for the Desert Astrolabe, I still have that quest running. It says gather bound research samples, and I think these samples drop from different tiered bound enemies, some of which I haven't encountered. So I'm just leaving it on the back burner and they'll eventually complete is what I think will happen and for the forest provisioner the NPC was Bass Reeves and he has some hunting quests where you have to shoot the heart and get some headshots I believe the desert provisioner essence trader had the shotgun schematic um, the swamp provisioner had the rifle schematic and then the forest provisioner has the pistol schematic so those are also very important so at the moment um as far as the main story goes, I have to travel to the desert herbarium. Okay, here we go. Uh, desert and then herbarium level 50. Open portal. What level am I at? I'm at gear score 43. Alright, here we go. The enemies are coming in. Probably level 50. Oh, they hurt. Oh, there's one more. There we go. Well, that's all of them. Okay, desert herbarium with miraculous plant growth fulfilled by ancient fey gardens. Okay. Oh, do we just. Oh, what the fuck? Am I in an underground sanctum? I think so. I ran into one of these before, so I'm assuming. It's the same thing, but more difficult. Oh yeah, this thing hurts. What the fuck? Oh, there we go. Ooh, I wonder what resources these are. Oh, that's coal, okay. I definitely want to grab this because coal is for bullets. And then this is. That's raw gem ember. Okay, I got some amber and coal. There's also this thing, which I don't know what this is. Okay, I can't farm that. Let me go ahead and get this. So let me go ahead and check this place out. Okay, the portal is open. Okay, there is a factions present in the company, and I think that's it. Continue. Ooh. Well, this looks kind of different. Oh. What are you? Oh, there's multiple. Let me go ahead and harvest these dudes. Ooh, tier two. At least those things are one shot, which is really nice. There's a there's a robot thing. Are you friendly? I think so. May as well beat him up. Oh, this is also tier 2. Okay. That has nothing inside it. Got some poison marble. Oh, whoa, Millie. Are you dying? No, you're good. Oh, that doesn't do a lot of damage. Neither does that. Okay. 
tier two parts as well. There's a drop down, yeah? No. Okay, that's a dead end. There is a chest over there. There we go. Okay, there's the door that I have to open, and then there's also that thing over there which I probably have to get to. I don't know if I have enough stamina to climb this thing. Well, let me try. I might just barely be able to make it. Oh yeah, okay, just barely. Yeah, I think that opened the door. Got my essence bundle. What is this? Plant fiber. Oh, I see a chest. Probably wood in here. Yeah. Let me go ahead and rest up. Okay, I probably have to solve this thing. That's the first one. That's the second one. Where's the third one at? Oh, I think that's the third one. Alright. And then that's the second. And then that should be the third. Yeah, that solved it. That should open the door. And it did, okay. Reach the portal, complete, okay. Activate mechanism. Another synchronous lotus. Oh, these are all T2 essences. Okay, that's nice. Ooh, I haven't fought one of these guys. Well, that's barely any damage. What? Okay, 86. 150. 160. I have to be super close. Okay, that's not effective at all. Let me try the hatchet. Oh, yeah, that's much better. We go ahead and heal up. Looks like Millie does not want to help me at all. Millie, what are you doing? Attack. Maybe now Millie will attack? No? Seems like Millie's totally bugged out. What is wrong with you, Millie? Let me go ahead and change you to, I guess. Let me try the hatchet. I don't know, Millie's kind of bugged out. Ooh, tier two, yes, please. Okay, I reached the essence trader. Ruben, what do you have? Ooh, refined climbing pick. Refined hammer. What is this? Hermetic flame. Shock wave. I'm just gonna buy everything. I think that is everything. Let me look at the resources real quick. We got shingles, bricks. Uh, what else is new? Charm, thread eye, salt. Okay, we got spice. All right, that's cool. Now I'm gonna head over to the Fey Tower, but what the fuck is this? Yeah, these are all explosives. Oh, what is this? Is this a new creature? Oh, oh holy shit, what the fuck are you? Is it hostile? I wonder if I could lure him to the bombs. Oh yeah, I think I triggered him. Oh, he spawns the bombs.
Oh, there's another one. Chill, dude. Oh, it's the fucking thing that's shooting me. I see. Let me go ahead and get all of this. Oh, there's one right behind me. I think that's everything. I want to be a little careful here. Hold on, let me see if I can heal up. Right, there we go. I should be able to get this guy now. Millie's about to die though. Let me get away. Millie's probably gonna go down soon. Let me repair my hammer. And then try to do another restoration. He's spawning more mines. Okay, I can probably res Millie here. Here we go, and then kill this dude. I think I'm fine. Yeah. There we go. Holy shit, what the fuck was that? Did it- Oh, I think that- Okay, that's the piece. It rolled all the way over here. Wait, don't tell me it despawned. Man, that's gonna- Oh, there we go, there it is. Tier 2 Automation Bishop. Okay. Okay, so for these things, for the favors, you can actually wait through until they cycle. And pick whichever one you want. And since I'm going to be doing the Fey Tower, I want to head with the Favor of Power. If there we go, that's the entrance. And it should function the same as the other towers. So this should trigger the enemies. Here we go. Oh yeah, there we go. Now I'm doing some juicy damage. Twice as much as what I was doing before. All done. Got 15 T2 Essence. Oh, I've never run into this one before. Oh, actually I have. Never mind, it's just enemies. Oh, hello. This is so easy with the power favor. Just absolutely melting these guys. There we go, that should finish it. And then I should have enough of the favor to finish off the rest of the guys. Oh, it's actually a boss. What the heck? Was not expecting that. Oh my goodness, look at the size of this dude. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Oh, actually, holy shit, I might die if I'm not careful. Let me go ahead and take this dude down. Oh, these guys are crazy. Oh my goodness, let me rescue Millie. Come here, sir. Oh, I can't knock him down. I'm out of stamina. Oh, I gotta run. Get Millie real quick. Alright, I would like to regen if I can. I don't think I can. How do I miss that? Oh, I don't have stamina. I am trapped. I'm gonna pop that for resistances. Alright, let me see if I can do a regen. Oh, that's not good. Okay, that did not reach me. Let me go get Millie real quick. Oh my goodness. Bad idea, bad idea. Okay, I'm gonna 
have to do another restoration. There's one of them. There we go, that dude is dead. I could go get Millie really quickly. Oh man, this is actually difficult. Where is Millie? There you are. Here we go. I think my frames are dropping a little bit. There we go, now it's just the boss left. Okay, I would like to use a regen. Oh my god, I was trying to rescue Millie. There you are, miss. Oh, whoa, chill dude, what the fuck? Dude has no chill. down again. Let me go ahead and harvest this. Okay, my backpack is full. So I'm gonna have to give some stuff to Millie. I think that's good enough. Okay. Oh, is, are there more? Oh no, wait, come on. You can't be serious right now. Wait, then who's alive? Does that mean I missed an enemy? Not sure, but it didn't complete. I'm guessing there's probably an enemy I missed. Yeah, there he is. Or she, or whatever. There we go. Okay, 58 T2 Essence. Let me get that as well. So we this Lotus. Okay, that unlocked the whole map. Now, oh, can I see the NPC? Nelly Bly. I just couldn't see it because like if you look at it, it's just, like completely covered up and it's so hard to see when the map is zoomed out. But that's where I gotta go now. Oh, is it all the way on top of that? Okay, I guess I have to somehow climb my way all the way up there. I don't know if it's possible or not, but... I don't think I have a choice. I wonder like if it puts you in a spot like this that's actually so messed up because with the heat and everything your stamina is so down and then you have to climb all the way up. Yeah there's literally no other way to get up here besides climbing and there's also so many people here. Hello? There's the essence trader and let me talk to you. Oh you got a bunch of stuff huh? Oh it's the same dude. I mean he has the same freaking stuff as the last dude. I already have all of this. Let me go ahead and talk to Nelly. We need the following. An Elder Eoton Heart, a Pelucidic Etched Ingot, Automaton Charm Oil. All attainable from specific fantastical creatures. Okay, that was a mouthful. But it seems I have to acquire three things. But based off of what she said, I would have to go into a hunt realm. And here is Puck. Hello, Puck. Ho, ho, ho. The Explorer's second doth keep her promises. An obedient cur. Not too fond of fairy folk, but who can blame the girl? 
While I regret that returning to Nightingale must wait many moons, Nelly's recourse has refilled your spirit, I see. The omen I carry is thus ill-timed. Whispers unfurl. Something is rotten in the realms, and it's more than the requiem being sung for Earth. As I took a knightly form, a little jay tittle-tattled in my ear. Reports of darkness past, and of darkness still to come. The pale may only be the beginning of Earthkind's woes. Yet, not all jays can be trusted. And thus, before I tell all, I'll pry where I can while you seek the innards of beasts for Miss Bly. Okay, so I'm guessing all three of those things, well at least two of them, she said is in the hunt realm, but for the time being I don't have access to hunt realms. Oh man, you know what sucks? What sucks is, if I have to come back and talk to her, I'm gonna have to scale the fucking mountain all over again. I completely forgot to turn in Wilmina's quest. Ah, you again, always a pleasure. I found the lawman you were so interested in. Oh now, this is exciting, did you get a name? Alright, he goes by Bass Reeves. Reeves, hmm? Doesn't ring a bell. But no matter, what I'd really love to know is what business he has in the realm. He's hunting a member of the 40 elephants who stole secret design documents from the Calcularia. Ah, uh, I wonder if it has the consequences. Let me turn it in, just as I thought. Oh, this is excellent. I'll have to keep my eyes and ears on it, but there's a wonderful story unfolding here. And we've got a front row seat. Oh, she can actually tell me where to find the things. I need to find someone who understands the ways of sun giants. I've received several reports of a swamp giant, or Grendel as they say, in a swamp gloom, who speaks a common tongue. Okay, so he'll be in the swamp gloom biome. Do you know of anyone knowledgeable about realm spirits? And what might you need that for, hmm? Visit an antiquarian swamp and you can thank me later. I did, I did visit the Antiquarian Swamp and there's an NPC there, I'm thinking that's what she's talking about. There were more than a few casualties, but I hear your expert, a woman called Ludivine St. Clair yet lives. Yeah, okay, I spoke with Ludivine before, but for the time being, Swamp Gloom and Swamp Antiquarian are where I have to go. 